locked in on the read and the speed. That was a good-looking putt, just not falling right now. Well, sadly, he's going to be disappointed. He has this for a birdie. You may have lost track at home, but we're keeping count, and that is nine under for the day. Did the job right there. Excellent front side, trying to keep it going here on the second nine. He's just playing beautifully, hitting so many good shots, giving himself so many opportunities. Can he keep it going? Couldn't ask for anything more. Uh, just the lie there, too. It is sitting up like it's teed up. Well, this one's sweet, Frank. Super. <laughs> Drivable par four. Not for most in this field, but for this guy, yes, he has just knocked it on. What a shot. It's in the hole. Just a sensational shot right there. That's a sneaky distance. Continues to amaze yet another birdie, and what a day it's been. We're now at the 11th hole, and this is a huge par five. 645 yards, Frank, that's a biggie. And plus, this hole bends to the right, which sort of makes you think that you can hit it down the right side. But if you miss down the right, there's just a multitude of bunkers that'll swallow up that ball, and you're nearly guaranteed to make at least six. That one is in the fairway, down there about 290 yards. Frank, this is a huge par five. How reachable is it? Well, probably chances of uh, getting home there. You're going to need something around the 340-yard mark off the tee. If you've done that, well, one thing to be aware of is that huge bunker, that huge deep bunker short left of this green. Seems to like it. Looks like it's headed for the green. About 25 feet from the cup. Frank, how challenging is this approach shot here at the 11th? Well, 645 yards. If you can get home here for two, well, that's a story you're going to tell your friends for many a day. needs to keep it steady here over the putt.
Frank, that's not one you're necessarily thinking about making. No, just a uh, good putt, though. There's no two ways about that. He's putting well. Not a gimme, but well within his range. Just an amazing display. The records continue to fall. For birdie. And he has it for birdie. Frank, the short par 3 12th, what are you looking to do? Well, you think it's a snack. Green straight in front of you, points a little bit to the right, but just getting it and keeping it on the green, it takes some doing. That birdie coming up, formality. Second shot. 13 under on the day. So just a formality here. That's the idea. Just knock it in. 13th hole now. And by the looks of this one, Frank, if you were right off the tee, things could go horribly wrong. Massive drop-offs and bunkers to the right. Doubtfully, you'd ever get a good lie if you missed this fairway on the right. So... Flip side, keep the ball down the left. Game's about rhythm. It, when you have good rhythm, it just looks effort, effortless. You hit the ball 300 yards through the air. That easy. Well, they claim it's a reachable par four. We haven't seen a whole lot of people do it today. We just saw it right there. Well done. want to check the GPS on a putt this long.
always two components to the long lag putt, the speed, number one, and then the read. And missed out on that second part. Getting set now over the putt. Very well done, almost made it. Yeah, there'll be no stress for the next one. Well, there's an opportunity wasted. Just knock it in for a par and let's forget about this one. Um, golf is not about perfect, but it's gonna hurt the course. That one got away. Solid par. He has this attempt for par. 15 under for the day. Frank, any major championship gives you a good mix of holes. We've had some long ones, and now this one just under 400 yards. But it will punish you if you're offline. There's trouble left and the mounds and the bunkers on the right. So ideally, it's a positional tee shot. safely on deck. What a display of power and precision off the tee. On the green here on the par four, in one. Good chance at one. This is a pretty long putt here. You'd be happy to get this to within two or three feet. You really want to take the stress out of that next putt. Could it be? In the words of the legendary basketball announcer, Marv Albert. Boom.